Are you? Today, how was your week? How was your week? Uh, Today is the finale, so you are doing everything. Mm -hmm. How was your week? I don't tire. I don't tire. You tire, huh? I don't tire. It's good that today is the finale. So Why? I can go and put my head somewhere. Right? <laughs> I want to find. I want to break my virginity. Where? <laughs> to who? Yeah, I don't know yet. <laughs> I want to find two different pillars and put my head in between it. Oh, put. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I just went there. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah, okay. Two different soft pillars. Then put my head there. I don't know. I'm so perplexed. Why? That you're able to say this in front of them. Like oh, two soft pillars. Which ones are soft pillars? I said, I want to say like two modes of pillars. Understand? Okay, let's just move away from that <laughs> because if you dwell on it, it will become so worse. Anyway, so uh huh. Uh, uh, sure, sure. Yeah. The Bible says, "Wait until marriage." Preaching to you, I'm an agent of God, or servant of God, or how agent. they say, Does agent. God have agent? <laughs> I'm a servant God of God. Have an agent. <laughs> agent of God. Is <laughs> the devil who has, a, who has an agent? <laughs> anyway, yeah. so welcome to the uh, season finale of um. Hats and humor. My name is Sarah Mag Sarah Madabra. When you call me say I'm always here with James Walter. Me and Tay. Yeah. Tapel. The sexiest name ever. That's the reason she likes it. Yeah. She it. It's like she's moaning it. Tapel. Tapel. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, she so since today is the season finale, we're going to put three dilemmas together. Maybe my the video might be long, yeah? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, the first dilemma. A mother and my husband is getting married in two weeks. Okay. The problem is the woman is going to stay in a house. The house is built together with a joint account. So, so that if in future we stay in Ghana, we can stay in. Oh. Help me. That is... Whoa. Yeah. So he's marrying a different woman. Mm -hmm. Who is the house one? that they've actually, uh, what do you call it, um, built together, together with a joint account. Yeah. Which is not, it's not fair. I oh, wonder how fair. their divorce even went. Because if they, they had a good yeah. divorce, they would have negotiated what yeah. they are going to do Maybe with the house. Maybe they might have sold the house. And yeah, yeah, and share the money and all those yeah. things. So but that, is, that, that is some crazy shit. If they've divorced and um, the man is actually really going, to, going to remarry, I don't think that is a house he needs to stay there. In, in uh, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. I they think need that to house should be fresh. Yes, exactly. Fresh so that house should be actually rented out. Mm hmm um maybe the remuneration or the what do you call it um the money that comes in yeah can be shared amongst them yeah and then you know they can stay in a different yeah, house exactly together. well so you know he mm. taking the lady he taking a different lady into a house that he built with his ex-wife it's a no-no it's a no-no sure yeah it's a no -no. Do, if i were to be the lady whom the guy is going to marry i'll tell him i do i do i only want to start my marriage on and on someone else's, yeah. what do you call it? Uh, the premises of someone, someone else's uh, toil. True. Uh, as a true. Desire. Uh -huh. So I would just advise the woman in question to um, talk to the, the husband or mm -hmm. talk to the, the lawyers who they, they exactly. use in the I think it's the lawyers, the lawyers who uh -huh. will be able to do it. So, yeah, so that they, they sell the house and then they get yeah. profit. So she can, she can see him to court. Yeah. One way or the other. So mm -hmm. that at least she can also get her work. Because it's not fair. Mm. It wouldn't be fair. She doesn't know anything about how the house was mm -hmm. built, nothing. Mm -hmm. She just and then I think she's also being shameless because if the guy is actually taking to a house that he and his wife built or his ex wife built, then I don't think he'll be like well probably she doesn't know. Probably Maybe he, she knows. If she knows then she's shameless. But if she doesn't know then, then the guy the know, man then, is I think the girl has to tell the, and say, yeah, this, yeah, is, yeah. this house was built by both both uh, of us. So, or no, just sue him this. to court. Yeah. Yes, it's as simple as that. Yeah, Just yeah. seem to call so that at least, you know. Yeah. Mm. Okay. And, and she's a born one too. Yeah, yeah born one. 
But I feel, I feel that it, has nothing to do with no, no, the story. The, 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 the child might end up claiming oh, the part house. of the house. It's true. When, like, who knows the future? No one knows it. But yeah, 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 yeah. the child might actually end up claiming part of the house. And as in, I mean, what the parents or her, her mother or the child's mother doesn't really know yeah, what's happening, yeah, yeah. about yeah. how the house was built or something. Mm. Yes, yes. Okay. So, next story. Yeah, sure. Okay. I have a problem and I need help. Okay. I'm a 34 year old girl and currently in a relationship with a guy who gives me so much peace, even though he doesn't have anything. Oh. <laughs> That's cute. Um, I feel we can build our lives together, mm. so I'm okay with him. Yeah, peace of mind is yeah is, is the most. I would rather be in a, in a peaceful relationship than being a toxic relationship that gives me a lot of money. Uh, are we beating you? Yeah, and, uh, abusive and now. Abusing you and all that. Peace when they mind. kill you, it is the money that they used to bury. I know. Mm. Um, but the problem is, he once told me I'm not tight. That sex is much enjoyable when a, a woman is tight. Okay. However, he keeps assuring me that he's okay with with me like that okay. honestly he doesn't make me feel bad about okay. it mm -hmm. and i appreciate his honesty but secretly it bothers me and i'm wondering why um it's so it's so with me she's wondering why it's so with her yeah okay. because i heard you can have a loose vj after giving birth or or um, if you sleep around with men a lot which that mm -hmm. which i don't feel a victim of Okay. Oh, okay. You had so, a man, so give us a man, a man's perspective on this. Man's perspective. Well, this idea it is tight. When it's tight, <laughs> it's enjoyable. <laughs> Understand? Why are you laughing? <laughs> oh, is it like the truth? If it is tight, it's shit. It's shit. What's that? It's just sad. It's just sad. It's just sad. It's all twanaks. Ah, I'm still a virgin. I want to bring my virginity very soon, though. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. I heard it. Oh, okay. Yes. It is assumed. Okay. Now it is alleged. Now it is I just saw uh, that. Yeah. Hmm. As when it's tight, it's, it's good. But when it's loose, to, it's not a what you call it. Um, enjoyable. It's not so enjoyable like that because, I don't know, say, when, it, when it's tight like this, you can be on and check your eye now. Oh. Because it's shit. You can see feelings move. Boom. But when it is loose, you can be as a woman to as I would say. So, but I feel sad. That is, well, since it's actually not, he actually brought it up. It means that it is something that he wants her to do something about. Yeah. But why is it why why is he not assuring her that it's like it's okay with he's, him? He's assuring her because he's he he realized that he's her peace oh. one way or the other. So. He's assuring her that uh, he's okay, regardless of the fact that it's not so tight, but I'm still okay with it. You mm. understand? Um, also, she said he gives her peace. Mm. You understand? So I feel sir, he also is not making, not to make her feel bad about it or something. He's actually assuring her that so it's okay, but it is Deep much down, enjoyable. Yeah. Saying, the sex media, it is much enjoyable if what? If it is tight. So she wants to, he wants, even though, regardless of the fact that he's actually trying to tell her that, oh, it's okay, I think it is something that he wants, like he wants her to work on. Mm. Even though she feels naturally, since she has not given birth before, or she, she has not really slept around before, she's supposed to have a title or something, but probably that was how she was also yeah. to you understand? So um, now I think there are various medicines, but then I feel there are side, side effects to those medicines sure. and stuff as well. So, um, I think she should seek a word you call medical help, yeah. Yeah, from a specialist, mm. let's say a medical advice or something from someone who is actually a specialist so that they can be able to advise um, her on what to do. Mm. I think that would be better. Maybe a gynecologist yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can prescribe some medicine for her so that at least yeah, 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 yeah. she can be able to. Yeah, but I don't think that should be a deal breaker. If she's giving you peace and he's giving you peace, why not? Because peace of mind. I, I do better. think that the guy is trying to be, I don't want to say, he, he, he's pretending on what he likes. No, the thing is, so the thing if is, I was to be in the lady's shoes, mm -hmm. even though he's trying to assure me, we are me that, like, oh, it's okay, it's okay. I 
think I'll go to the hospital and go and see a guy exactly. now. That's uh, that's what I said. No, the guy actually, regardless of the fact that you know, he said he mentioned it because he felt published might have some sites so want might want to do something about it. So yeah, so you don't don't, don't reassure. But then again, don't tell me that she, he's okay. reassuring her because he said he's trying to tell her that it is not a deal breaker. Oh, you understand? It is not a deal breaker. Mm. But sex is enjoyable if the pussy is tight. Mm. You understand? That is Maybe it. he's sick too small. That's why. <laughs> that's another angle. Uh, emotional damage. Uh, <laughs> Maybe it's not about her sin. Probably, but she has also not complained about her thing. Well, yeah, because it's okay. No, that, with, she's okay the, with that it. That is the thing. She has also not complained about his dick, which means that probably he's sizable enough. Mm -mm. Probably. Yeah, which means sometimes. that probably. Uh -huh. And I'm a patcher. Oh. Once I did know. But I feel that I feel that the girl is worried because of the fact that she said she has stayed for a long, like a while, like she doesn't really have sex around, she doesn't sleep yeah. around, so she doesn't understand the reason why mm. it is big. But but not because she's thinking be, that the, the there girl might also be, her. there might also be another caveat. Oh. Regardless of the fact that she's not sleeping around, she's not um, like having sex around and all that. You know, um, does she use any form of sex toy? Does she use any form of what do you call it? These, mm, um, yeah, that's another thing. Uh, what do you call it? Um, these cocoon yeah. and stuff that people yeah, will be sexing yeah, in their, yeah, their yeah. vaginas and stuff. No? Does she use sure, any of those yeah. things? Because if that, then um, she might have actually caused a harm to herself. Sure. And I that's believe that even though she's not even sleeping with human beings and stuff, she's actually sleeping with silicones and yeah. stuff. And it might cause harm to herself as that's well. True. So, that's yeah. True. But I believe, you know, um, she should seek a, a specialist, what do you call it, advice from, yeah, from yeah. what do you call it, like a good advice. I'm also thinking from. that both of them should go together. Maybe the problem is not the woman, it's the man. It's Maybe he has pump. a... a, a, a Uncle uh, pump it. <laughs> <laughs> you can pump it. And they said they have that, in a, I saw one thing be like that. I said a glass, my guy did share. And on me, I said, in from any tree, I didn't know. Challenge. Yeah. Wow, Ooh. it would be painful, Papa. I mean, Charlie, we, we are natural grown, so we don't know if we are big or small, but uh, they appreciate it when they. Yeah. I'm still a virgin. Yeah, I've been chicken more. I've been chicken myself, but still. Inshallah. <laughs> I'm still a bit. But yeah. I really I feel she should seek a medical advice. Yeah. A med advice from a specialist so that she will know what to do. But and they can both go put, together like this. Putting my specific. putting myself in the in the lady's shoes. I'll be I'll be so embarrassed. I'll feel so much shame and no. guilt going to see a gynecologist just to look at my down day to see if everything is okay. That's but it. people actually go to the gynecologist very useful. And people go there to see if they have cervical cancer or whatever, or yeah, like get they go for pregnancy those things, and those things. The pregnancy but it has nothing to do with some uh, people go. Oh, really? They, uh, or maybe they might seek uh, what do you call it an advice. So it's not like you examine the place, yeah. but they might. Oh, why are you saying he? She. He or she. She. Uh, he or she. She. He, she. And <laughs> uh, so he, she. I don't think I would he, she want a male guy. There are a lot of male gynecologists. I don't want to. be able to see. Nope. Uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. I real like, yeah. So, um, go to a gynecologist, get examined. They might examine you, or they might prescribe some medicine so that you know. Yeah. Might be okay. Okay. Next story, right? Yeah. Next story. Okay. Ta ta ta. Okay. What is the ta ta ta? Ta ta ta. 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 Ta ta I give no, like, I pref da, I da. refuse to put my 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 mind in the gutter. So explain it to me. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't say I give it like da da da. Any other day. Da da. Mama, you see, it's a it's a song. Okay. If I come back again, da da da. Come back again, da da da. Thank you. Oh God. So it's, okay. I give it like that that that. But, ah. but that, 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 somebody called somebody and said, Ah, Mama, and now 
me na mo dan echi no mi te se na o no wa e ku bo tatata o ba tatata pa i was say ah e dey le tatata no mimi ni around o ma two point two weeks kere ni i was say oh sir they say e dey le tatata no say oh tatata me e nyu bi e bo tiktok and i say it's like come back again i'm you like that 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 when they drop it i say eh akwa bi e guy 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 le bi no okay let's sorry Sure. Okay, my my wife is taking this issue so far. Okay. You know this statement men usually write as joke uh-huh. and when their wives ask for mother's day gifts. Uh-huh. They are like um, you are not my mom, you okay. are my wife. Okay. I said the same thing to my wife a couple of days ago. Oh, okay. My wife right. has gone silent on me. Oh. <laughs> um I said it as a joke. Mm-hmm. God is my witness. Mm-hmm. <laughs> In fact, she had been hinting what she wants as a gift and had already uh, bought it before this issue happened. Oh. Okay. Um, we've been married for almost a year, and uh-huh. this is the first Mother's Day, Mother's Day celebration as her wife. Okay. And this joke ruined everything at hand. At uh-huh. hand. Okay. We don't have a child yet. Oh. Um, she had been silent since the day since that day. Even though she she does her wifely duty, which one is her wifely duties? Like, uh, like if they chop, um, if they cook for us, we have that kind of stuff. He's eating, he's eating, he's eating. I apologized. Okay. Say <laughs> so the wifely duties. Is like that. Yeah. I have apologized. Regardless, I'm saying, I'm betting you're down on Uncasa. Eh, Uncasa. Do it. I give it like that. That. <laughs> <laughs> you are telling on yourself you know that right no i'm actually I've, I've read a lot that's hence the reason why i can be able to contribute to a lot of things yes, yes. so i've read a lot of things a lot <sighs> <laughs> i can see i can see it it's a, uh-huh, okay um she's been she's been silent since then even though she's been doing her wifely duties okay. i've apologized and everything but she's still angry she mm-hmm. even rejected the gifts I got. I got her oh. and went ahead to cancel all the plans I had for, for that day. Wow. She woke up this morning and told me um, she's going to spend the day with her mother. So I should also spend the day with mine. <laughs> she wrote something on the WhatsApp state was making it look like I made that statement because we don't have kids yet. Oh. Aww. It's a very sensitive thing for her. Um. She's still, she's still not back from her mother's place. What do I do? Oh. It's very sensitive for her. It's a sensitive yeah, issue for her. I Probably think, people around her have told painted. No, no, no. I think due to the fact that she... That's her first Mother's Day that yeah. she, you know, she felt it might be special. Mm. She felt the guy would be uh, like considerate. Yeah. But... You know, from the guy's point of view, to the storytellers yeah, or the yeah, guy's no. point of view, no. you know, from his point of view, right? I believe he wanted to create a situation whereby it looks like, oh, I have not been doing that. Oh. that kind of thing. But then again, you understand that at the end, you surprise right. her with something. Oh. You understand? So, I believe it was lack of communication, communication. one way or the other, and but lack, of, the, lack of understanding. You. Oh. Lack of understanding with regards to that aspect. I quite remember. If, uh, I know someone who actually wanted to surprise his wife with a, a brand new car. Oh, right. Yeah. I want a brand new car. Husband to be. Are you hearing? Learn from this story. Okay, continue. I'm not telling you. <laughs> Are you hearing those stories? I just see what your colleagues are doing. Okay, continue. <laughs> the intro of the story. Maybe a cry or at least you. Anyways. But you see, um, he wanted to surprise the wife with a brand new car. Mm. So this is what he did. In the morning, he didn't greet the wife. Okay. Pretend that as if he has forgotten that it's her birthday. Okay. Went to work. He went about this with the wife. Called him, he didn't mind her. Wow. And see, you know. Oh, it's so like, painful. And then he came back, he was actually trying to pick fights with the wife. So he realized that the wife was a bit down. 
and then he just like folded the car keys. What's that there? You know, they shared in some. And one is my end of this, and I say, Happy birthday, my darling. It was all planned. What's that there? No? She was like, Oh, the all was. Hi, Erin. The all was more because she never anticipated it. She didn't really. Um, like I never expected, expected it. it. Yes. She wasn't expecting it, so mm -hmm. it was it was more the impact was more mm -hmm. than the fact that oh babe I want to buy you a car. Yeah, oh so yeah. yeah. It, so but that's it, many ways including like, the cards though. No, it, it will make you uh, a bit predictable, like uh, like when you're dropping hints that you know. But I believe say men, some men are built like that, mm -hmm. like they would actually come and then like do a safe oh massa, you do the hear them, nothing, nothing, nothing. By the end of the day, they would, they would surprise you in the most beautiful way that you, you know. So I believe the guy was actually trying to do that. That is from my perspective. Okay. I believe the guy was actually trying to adapt to something like that. Mm -hmm. And yet still, it backfired. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, you know, the, the, like the woman mis, uh, misinterpreted yeah. what he actually mm. was trying to do. But I also think that this is suited from something else. Maybe it's what? rooted from something else. Okay. Maybe people like you know Ghana when after giving after marriage now. Oh, when I give him birth, like when I give, almost a year. No, but when I, I give him birth, when I give him birth. No, I, I feel like no because why would she be thinking that oh exactly. the, um, I'm not, we have not given birth yet, so that's exactly. why. No, but I don't think I I, I don't see the correlation between. And besides, I'm, one, year, saying that one year is too soon more, for her to. I know. You understand? I don't see the correlation between her, what you call it, um, her not what you call it, um, having a child, or her not giving a birth uh, within a year of their marriage. I don't see the correlation between that and the fact that you are not my mother, you are my wife. Mm. You understand? I don't see how that resonates with the fact that she doesn't have a, a child. That's what I said in my oh, probably in my I feel say she because she's not a mother yet. He's feeling uh, that um let's say uh because she's not a mother yet and say I say um like you are ob, 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 yeah yeah looking ha, down on yeah, me. Looking down on me. Yes. Uh, I wanted to use the three word. Oh, you have yeah, a three word okay. that she is a ubumi, something, something, something. Yeah, I don't know the three word. I'm a gun, in your gun. You understand? So I feel from that angle too, that is what um, she might be thinking, mm. understand. But I believe it was a romantic thing that backfired based on this miscommunication. Uh, that's not, see, I'm a very soft person. Don't don't be hard on me. Hey, Papa. Oh Papa. <laughs> oh la hey, it will be great. Hey, you are hard. No, when I say I'm very soft, I mean like my mood, I'm very sensitive in certain things. Mm. So I'm very soft. You mm. see, don't don't come and be rude to me and escort me. It's rude. You're rude. Oh, you're, you're not I my mother. You're my wife. Really? You're yeah, not my mother. Uh, Mas, there are many ways. Probably in the said he might have even laughed about it because he said, "Masa, masa, you're not my mother. You're uh, my wife." Uh, you something of a sort. Like you should actually be, see. Well. Women, I guess, I guess, sometimes they are complicated. That's and I why think I said that. There are certain things that we guys need to come out and Yeah. Then... Yeah. That's why initially I said that, like, it might be rooted in something else. Maybe some people have been telling her that, like, she needs to have children. But why would you need so, to listen to the naysayers? Oh, please. And then what do you call When it? you're under pressure, you didn't. You didn't... Under what pressure? Who is putting pressure on her? Society. One year. Plus, maybe Society. her age. What? Let me see her age. Oh, they, they didn't give her age. She didn't state her age. Oh. Maybe she's good. Maybe like she's in the late um mid thirties. You can't guess. Maybe. You maybe. Can't and then guess. maybe society is also giving her pressure. Society is giving her pressure. See. Did you marry for society or did you marry for your husband? You didn't marry for society. Oh, see, I, you I married your husband I, because you love the your your husband. You understand? Listen, so no. if he doesn't have a problem you, with it, you are not in that to, situation. I understand you. I totally understand you. But from the perspective that she's actually talking about, I feel because she doesn't have a child. And she's not a mother yet. That's the reason why the guy said that. You understand? But the guy is also saying that he's actually joking with it because he wanted to create that illusion that he doesn't care. And then what do you call it? Um, open up at the end of the day and then send her out, give her a nice treat, do things for her, and even the things that she even requested, she, he bought it. You understand? So he actually wanted to do something nice for her. 
you get it by some misinterpretation of something and misconception and i said when dream we once i did and also she might not have understood yeah the code that you know yeah. once there are many okay one there, there are many angles to this maybe she was on a tour maybe society for, <laughs> see you don't know i'm telling you we are very sensitive when we are not here i'm just putting it out there we're very sensitive but, it didn't state that she was on her period. I'm just saying many angles. I just I second what what you said that maybe the lady misunderstood the whole situation. Exactly. That's what that's not what the guy meant. Mm -hmm. But I didn't like the way you were supporting the guy that I was not also giving him points, him. you know. See, I, I was not I was not supporting. Shania, you know. <laughs> I was just <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I was not supporting him. Okay. I'm not supporting him. Oh. I, I ho actually hope you understand what I'm trying to say. Yeah, and I, I say, um, let's see, um, get the angle I'm coming from. <laughs> I like Get the <laughs> angle. I'm not supporting him. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? But I feel, say, I understood what he wants to do. Okay. Because he said, he said it out of play. And besides, it's just a year of marriage. Mm. You understand? So I don't think the woman should put so much pressure on herself in terms with of regards kids. to the kids and stuff. You understand? And it's a year. I also so have they been trying for kids? They, well, they, they didn't, you understand? So if they've not been trying for kids, it's it all depends. Okay, are we trying for kids? Are we doing this? Are we doing that? You understand? But well, I I, I super enjoy this season though. What did you enjoy about this season? What did I enjoy? Uh, I wouldn't say I enjoy people's dilemmas. Oh. But um, at least I enjoy sharing an opinion mm. with regards to like situations and things that people actually are encountering and experiencing. Yeah. Mm. And I believe that um, one way or the other, maybe one of the things or two of the things that we might have said has been sound. In the ears of you people, know yeah. um those watching and also they also have been able to contribute their what do you call it their little quota to it to make it more interesting mm -hmm. and you know but i believe that um we all should actually uh, um, contribute one way or the other mm -hmm. yeah so that at least uh, we also know your mind yeah i'll be reading them you know, and you know and she then she has time to read it you read it she read yeah, i'll read everything right? because <laughs> People are more yeah. than the fans, and I fans and fans. Cool. I say more than more than air conditioning. Cool. Air conditioning, I say. Air conditioning, I say. This answer, I say. So, yeah, I think yeah. But all in all, this it has been fun. Yeah, it's uh, been the, fun. the podcast has been very yeah, fun. Yeah, it's been fun. I really enjoyed myself. Yeah, I learned um, a lot though. Like it opened my not from you. But from people's story, not from you. Oh, look at then What did you bring? I learn from people's stories. Like it opens my mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I really, I really enjoyed my time yeah. with Sarah. Though yeah, we bonded. Um, that was certain not things. Not bonded. We, uh, we've been bonding already. Oh. Oh. Uh, but on the real, like, I've, I've really enjoyed my time with you know Sarah. I really enjoyed the various episodes and stuff. Um, being able to contribute to her amazing works Aww. and um, yeah. I believe you also have to contribute to her work to make yeah. it more what you call it. Yeah, subscribe. So, um, no, no, hit subscribe, no. like, like it, share, share, comment, you know, Do say all things. your, all your destiny, you know, yeah. but then it's been but a I, want, I really want to know your, your, your take, your take on all the stories that we read today. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll there are all three of them. So yeah. we'll be waiting to hear your opinion. Mm -hmm. And if you don't tell us, we'll, we'll bring cake. Yeah, they are chilling. We'll bring cake. <laughs> Come and kill you because you're watching. Yeah, it, is, it, is, it takes so hard, like yeah. so much time to do these yeah, things. Yeah, we spent how many hours now? Cutting, on, on, yeah. you know, and all that. It's it's, it's, it's just lot. crazy. Yeah. You understand that? Like, if you're having support, it changes you more to, to do more. Do more. You yeah. understand? So I believe 
yeah you guys should support us or support her yeah. support us my channel yeah, is needed i uh, hope by the time you are done with this like you are done watching um his his channel and his um social media handles yeah. like also pop up and like yeah. blow up mine has it will kick off very soon i actually have kick i kicked off a while back but i stopped because of some few things but i'm back at it again i'll be back at it again hopefully by the mid of this year so. okay i'll see you guys in the next episode right i yes. want something to say yes oh what do you want to say i love you guys oh i love you guys too bye <laughs> come, come for a hug come for a hug <laughs> ah.